Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about a new update to the Paint app that was released by Microsoft, of course, for Windows 11 in the dev channel. So when the first Windows 11 version of the Paint app came up, a lot of users were kind of upset that Microsoft didn't update the whole app. A lot of dialogues, a lot of windows from the Paint app were still having the old design from Windows 7, Windows 10, or whatever. But Microsoft worked a bit more on the Paint app and released an update today. And in this video, I will show you what is new and how the Paint app now matches the Windows 11 experience better. So we are now in the Paint app. Basically, the Paint app as an interface looks the same as the old version that was released for the dev channel. But we have some new dialogues. If we click on this spot on Edit Colors, we have a new window that appears, as you can see, a new design really really nice design that matches the windows 11 experience where you can enter the hex value you can set rgb or hsv or of course you can set the rgb manually and also you can create custom colors and you have the list of basic colors in the left side if you click on the resize button we also have a new dialog that is called resize and skew and we have of course the resize option with a percentage or pixels and we can type in here the resolution and also skew if you want you can enter the degrees for example 20 degrees and the result will be this one this is good news i think microsoft is listening to us they saw that a lot of users were kind of upset that this new paint app wasn't really consistent it of course had a really nice design and i love the design but some of these dialogues weren't as they should be to match the windows 11 experience as i've said and this new update also a few fixes were applied to the paint app now if you use shift plus click on a certain color that color will be selected as the secondary color so that is really interesting they also fixed an issue where text boxes would move unexpectedly when using IME they fixed an issue where some dialogues were not properly localized in Hebrew Dutch Norwegian and other languages and also they improved support for screen readers this is a small little update to the paint app but I decided to make a video about it because this is really good news I'm really glad that Microsoft listens to their users and they provide updates and changes where they are needed. Of course, updates are needed more on other parts, but it's good that they're starting with this paint app. And of course, today we're going to receive a new dev channel build and we'll see what comes new in that build. If you're wondering how to get this update, simply just open up the store in Windows 11, go to library in the left side, click on get updates and then update all and the paint app should be automatically updated. If you found this video useful, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.